Rat Control on Farms video series. Trapping options. In the previous video, we discussed how to know if you have rats on your farm and things you can do to keep them away. If you have taken preventive measures and rats still persist, there are a number of control options available. Remember, trapping or poisoning are not effective long-term solutions if prevention measures have not been followed carefully. Rat Traps Spring-loaded snap traps Snap traps specifically designed to kill rats can be an effective method to control these rodents. The key to success is placing the snap traps in strategic locations to let the rats familiarize themselves with the traps before they are set. Rats are very suspicious of changes in the environment, so it is important to pre-bait the traps before you place them. When setting and baiting traps, use plastic gloves to avoid leaving a human scent. Choose a food that the rats cannot resist and sticks to the trap. You might have to try a couple of times before you find the perfect bait. Once baited, place the traps inside and outdoors along the perimeters of structures, identifying routes well-traveled by rats, next to walls, behind objects, in dark corners, or close to where a rat enters or exits a structure. Traps set outside need to be placed in a bait station. Otherwise, you might accidentally kill or injure a pet or non-target wildlife such as songbirds. If rats are traveling along rafters and pipes, Fasten the traps to these locations using screws or wire. After a few days, you are ready to set the traps. Check traps every three to five days and reset and bait trap as needed. You should detect a decline in the signs of rats within four weeks of trapping. Glue boards and sticky traps are not recommended as they have been found to be inhumane. There is also a significant risk of accidentally killing non-target animals like songbirds and bats. Alternative Trap Types There is also a new product that kills instantly using a self-resetting bolt. This trap is easy to install and works without toxins or electricity. If there is no decline in rat activity within 35 days or bait is still being consumed, reassess the situation. Ensure that preventive measures have been fully implemented. Discuss preventative measures with neighbors to coordinate efforts for better success. If rats are still present after preventive measures have been implemented and other trapping options have been utilized, rodenticides are a last resort to control a rat infestation. Watch the next video in the Rat Control series to learn how to safely and effectively apply rodenticide. This video series would not have been possible without the help of sponsors and key participants.